Trending Jobs Globally for 2022 Worldwide, the next gen of ideas and businesses have been launched because of the onset of the pandemic. Digitization has entered multiple streams of business, and if one is on the lookout for jobs, they should be skilled and updated on current trends. Globally, the job scenario has changed dramatically since the onset of the pandemic. Work from home or a work from anywhere situation has developed. Virtual interviews and onboarding of jobs, everything is done over Zoom or a Teams call. This is a post from your favorite education guide, College Suggest. Know your course, know your career. In this video, let's explore what are the trending jobs globally for 2022. Lots of changes from working style to meetings over video calls, upskilling, trying to shift to new careers and new jobs are all of the things going on in the minds of a majority of people nowadays. Globally also, the job scenario is changing and this video brings you the careers which have demand globally in 2022 so that you can train yourself and apply for those jobs accordingly. Job seekers and freshers have numerous questions on their minds about their career and the future at large like, will this career choice be the right one? If it will help us earn a good salary and help us progress to the next level? If the chosen career has global demand or is it just country specific? Are there any specific qualities required to get hired for jobs abroad? In this video, we're going to give you all the information you need regarding trending jobs one can apply for in 2022 worldwide. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite courses and careers. Let's first look at some stats regarding the job market. Recent trends suggest that 2022 is the year to make a change in your career. One of the reasons being the great resignation, where millions of people are quitting their jobs, which can either open up a lot of job opportunities or can mean that those who are resigning their jobs are planning to make a career switch. The US Bureau of Labor Statistics revealed in one of its latest data reports that an average person holds 12.4 jobs between the ages of 18 and 54. Another survey by CNBC shows that 76% of workers want to have more flexibility in their job, with the priority being working remotely. The pandemic has changed not only the working conditions, but has also brought some of the unpredicted career choices to become the highest paying jobs. Healthcare, medical, data analysis, and sectors related to information technology have skyrocketed during this period and also projects itself as promising career choices for the near and upcoming future. Let's now see in detail about the trending 10 jobs globally for the year 2022. In no particular order, we are presenting the jobs that will be in demand for the year 2022 worldwide. First on our list is an artificial intelligence specialist. According to a global data report, the artificial intelligence industry will rise to 190 billion US dollars in 2025 compared to 67 billion US dollars in 2021. Big tech companies like Apple, Amazon, Google, Meta or Facebook, Microsoft will be the prominent users of artificial intelligence. LinkedIn's Emerging Jobs report indicated that the growth in this job sector has increased 74% over the last four years. Some of the use cases where companies will focus to invest in AI software for 2022 will be in virtual assistants, autonomous vehicles, crowdsourced data, a digital workplace, and knowledge management. To become an AI specialist, one should possess skills such as familiarity with machine learning softwares, Python programming, deep learning, cloud computing, and so on. Also, there will be an added advantage if one has experience in TensorFlow, NumPy, Scikit-Learn, and PyTorch. The average salary of an AI specialist in India is Rs 13 lakhs. In the US, it is $125,000 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £75,000 per annum. In Canada, it is $99,996 per annum. The second job that we will be looking at is the data scientist. According to a Modor intelligence report, the global data science industry was valued to be $31.05 billion US dollars in 2020 and it is projected to reach 230.8 billion US dollars in 2026 with a CAGR of 39.7%. The role of a data scientist will include mining and exploring huge amounts of data from various sources. They will also be building data models, deploying these models into production and presenting the reports. It is estimated that a lot of data is going to be generated with each passing year. 
indicating a demand for this career choice. Some of the key sectors where data scientists are needed are banking, research, telecommunications, and information technology. Some of the required skills include knowledge of programming languages such as Python, Perl, SQL, and Java. Other skills include familiarity with data analytics tools such as SAS and Hadoop. Also, data mining, data visualization, and data integration are good to possess. The average salary for a data scientist in India is Rs. 8,60,316 per annum. In the United States, it is $97,062 US dollars. In Canada, it is $79,837 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £40,772 per annum. The third job that we're going to look at is the robotics engineer. Robotics is going to be a part of all the business sectors and all the big tech companies have already invested a lot of money in this industry. According to global data, the robotics industry is going to be worth 568 billion US dollars by the year 2030, compared to 45 billion in 2020. The demand for robotics engineers is soaring. Their main duties include design, building, and trying to operate and maintain these robots efficiently. Now let's have a look at the skills that a good robotics engineer should possess. Good knowledge of Python programming, also possess knowledge of artificial intelligence, must be a critical thinker, should be able to solve complex problems and the ability to create new and useful things, as well as be able to adapt and learn quickly. The average salary for a robotics engineer in India is Rs. 4,33,102 per annum. In the United States, it is 85,047 US dollars per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is 31,461 pounds per annum. And in Canada, it is 71,136 Canadian dollars per annum. The fourth job that we're going to look at is the full stack developer. A full stack developer is a professionally versatile person who is experienced in both the front and back end of a web application. A full-stack developer will be paid different salaries according to different geographical locations, as well as how technically advanced they are in different coding languages. They can also venture into various sectors such as banking, accounting, information technology, telecommunications, and insurance. Some of the skills that a full-stack developer must possess include knowledge about HTML and CSS, JavaScript, Angular, React, Vue, Python, PHP, Ruby, database management systems, good communication skills, time management, multitasking skills, being inquisitive and creative in mindset would also be an added advantage. The average salary of a full stack software developer in India is 6,54,453 rupees per annum. In the United States, it is 79,521 US dollars per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £35,332 per annum, and in Canada, it is $70,161 per annum. The fifth job that we're going to look at is the cloud engineer. All the companies now store their information and data in the cloud, so skilled personnel are required to maintain and manage this, and that is why cloud computing software skills are gaining popularity worldwide. Some of the sectors that are mainly using this service are IT, financial services, telecommunications, and the education sector. Global data forecasts that the cloud computing market will be worth 616 billion US dollars by the end of 2022, an increase of 13% compared to 2021. And according to Grandview Research, the global cloud computing market will reach a growth of 1.25 trillion US dollars by 2028. So it is worth it to gain appropriate certifications and training in this field to secure a job in the future. A cloud engineer tries to fix the bugs, monitor issues, handles day-to-day -day management and solutions necessary within the infrastructure. Now let's look at what are the skills a cloud engineer must have. Must be proficient in programming skills. No Linux, DevOps, virtualization skills, be skilled in containerization tools and understand Docker and Kubernetes, and also be familiar with web services and application programming interfaces. The average salary for a cloud engineer in India is 6,45,000 rupees per annum. In the United States, it is $97,701 per annum. 
In the United Kingdom, it is £47,543 per annum, and in Canada, it is £73,437 Canadian dollars per annum. The sixth job we're going to see is the sales engineer. Sales is an important part of any business. A sales engineer is responsible for selling technological products, scientific research products, and also selling different types of services to a variety of businesses. Sales engineers must possess an in-depth knowledge of the entire product. According to the Occupational Outlook Handbook by the Bureau of Labor Statistics United States Report, the employment of sales engineers is projected to grow by 8% from 2020 to 2030, which is similar to the growth rate of other jobs. Now let's examine the responsibilities of a sales engineer. They should have a good client relationship, they should be able to deliver technical presentations to explain their products to the customers. They must help in securing new orders to their companies and help customers with a smooth plan to fulfill their needs, as well as complete the entire transaction correctly. They should be able to support their customers post the sales of the product as well. Let's see what are the skills required for a successful sales engineer. You must possess strong interpersonal skills, good presentation and communication skills, and should be able to do thorough research about the product they are selling. The average salary of a sales engineer in India is 3,14,883 rupees per annum. In the United States, it is $74,441 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £32,646 per annum. In Canada, it is $67,615 Canadian dollars per annum. The seventh job that we're going to look at in detail is the cybersecurity analyst. With more data being generated compared to before by all the companies, it has become a priority for organization leaders to invest more money in protecting their data. Cybersecurity is a relatively new profession and it is growing rapidly, and they are now in more demand than ever before. According to a Mordor Intelligence report, the cybersecurity market was valued at 156.24 billion US dollars in 2020, and it is expected to grow to 352.5 billion US dollars by 2026, with a CAGR of 14.5%. So, what exactly does a cyber analyst do? A cybersecurity analyst's main duty is to protect the company's network and servers, to prevent security breaches and make sure that the digital assets of the company are well protected. They train employees about security of data and help in software installation, encryption and respond immediately to any suspicious activity. Let's explore the skills required to become a cybersecurity analyst. They should have knowledge of Linux, Kerberos, Splunk, scripting, familiarity with necessary frameworks such as the National Institute of Standards and Technology (NIST). Center for Information Security, CIS, knowledge about cloud technology and threat assessment. There is a shortage of skilled cybersecurity analysts globally, so there is a good chance that you could bag yourself a job in this industry if you equip yourself with proper training, certification and experience. Now let's look at the average salary of a cybersecurity analyst in India. It is Rs. 5,72,579 per annum. In the United States, it is $76,986 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £31,260 per annum. In Canada, it is $65,938 Canadian dollars per annum. The eighth job that we're going to look at is the general physician, doctors. The physician and healthcare professional market industry is projected to grow from $1,382.18 billion US dollars in 2021 to 1502.43 billion US dollars in 2022 at a compound annual growth rate of 8.7% CAGR according to a report published by the business research company the first set of prescriptions is generally given by a general practitioner who assists in diagnosing the patient with general checkups and if needed a further examination they then collect general information about the medical history of the patient as well as other test results if the treatment scope is within their limit, then they explain it to the patient clearly and treat them. Otherwise, they would recommend that the patient visit a specialist to treat their ailment further. Some of the skills of a general physician are that they should have thorough medical knowledge. They should be able to take critical decisions quickly and correctly. Good attention to detail, a willingness to keep learning and adapting to scenarios, and 
a lot of patience to treat everyone. With today's digital intervention, telemedicine, online consultations, artificial intelligence and IoT devices will alert the doctors if the patients are falling ill. So the medical world is also getting a lot of new digital inventions, which is making treatment options easier and quicker. The average salary of a doctor in India is 7 lakh 12 rupees per annum. In the United States, it is 157,920 US dollars per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is 57,130 pounds per annum. In Canada, it is 145,964 Canadian dollars per annum. The ninth job that we're going to look at is the investment banker. Investment bankers are people who help companies go public, they raise money, help in acquisitions, mergers with big companies, and help in expanding a business. They act as intermediaries between investors and companies. It was reported that the global investment banking, along with trade services, was estimated to be valued at 267,864 million US dollars in 2019 and has projected a growth of 520,026 million US dollars by 2027, with a CAGR of 5.8% from the year 2020 to 2027. Some of the skills that an investment banker should have include being confident with numbers, they should have a good professional network, good analytical skills, must be intellectual, should have relationship building skills and communication skills. The average salary of an investment banker in India is Rs 9,42,633 per annum. In the United States, it is US$101,251 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £57,937 per annum. And in Canada, it is Canadian dollars per annum. The tenth job that we're going to look at is the Process Development Scientist. One of the most talked about career choices in the recent trend is to start a career in science and with the ongoing pandemic, a lot of people have started choosing this field. Let's take a look into what a process development scientist actually does. Vaccine development is the most sought after nowadays and a process development scientist plays a major role in developing one. They help in growing cell culture for the manufacturing of proteins or viruses which can be used in the production of vaccines. They then scale up the product with proper standardized protocols and approvals. Now, let's look at the responsibilities of a process development scientist. They are planning, developing methods for carrying out experiments in the lab and scaling it up in manufacturing plants, validating the process and developing methods of reducing cost. Some of the skills required for a process development scientist include good analytical thinking and a problem-solving attitude effective communication, researching and writing skills, which is needed, and the person should also be a team player in order to coordinate with a group of researchers to develop the final product. They can find jobs in pharmaceutical industries, food and cosmetic industries. The average salary of a process development scientist in India is Rs. 4,11,157 per annum. In the United States, it is US$72,886 per annum. In the United Kingdom, it is £26,541 per annum. In Canada, it is £67,246 Canadian dollars per annum. These are the 10 trending jobs globally for the year 2022. We hope this list brings the information that job seekers are looking for in terms of applying for jobs globally. A lot of new sectors are emerging as forerunners for 2022. So equip yourself necessarily to secure your dream job. We hope that we've given you all the details about the jobs trending globally for the year 2022. What is the course that you want to pursue next? Tell us and we will give you all the information you need to make the right decision. If you agree with our analysis, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and for more information, visit collegesuggest.com.